Hello, my dear friends. Welcome to Top Scholars. Today we'll be discussing about salt and its type. Now, as we know, salts are formed by something known as neutralization reaction. And what is neutralization reaction? Yes, neutralization reaction is a reaction wherein an acid reacts with a base, resulting in the formation of salt and water. So, a neutralization reaction is wherein an acid reacts with the base to give you salt and water and this neutralization reaction as you can see gives you the product salt right and the topic that we were discussing today is simply salts right so now friends as we said salt is formed right during a neutralization reaction this salt can be broadly classified into three categories that is acidic salt basic salt and neutral salt now acidic salt has ph that is less than 7. Basic salt has pH greater than 7, whereas neutral salt has pH equal to 7. So, we have three types of salt, right? Acidic, basic and neutral salt. Let's first discuss about acidic salt, right? Now, acidic salt are salts which on dissolving in water or a solvent results in the formation of a solution and this solution is acidic in nature. So, acidic salts are salts whose solution are acidic in nature. For example, here I have an acidic salt that is ammonium chloride. When we take ammonium chloride and dissolve it in water, it forms a solution, right? The solute dissolves in water and gives you a solution, right? Now, during this formation of solution, what happens is the chloride ion of the ammonium chloride, it combines with the hydrogen ions of water, giving you HCl. And as we know, HCl is a strong acid, hydrochloric acid. Whereas the ammonium ions, they combine with the OH minus ions of water and give you ammonium hydroxide, which is a weak base. So friends, here in this case, as you can see, we've got HCl, right? And HCl is a strong acid. Now, since a strong acid is formed, that is the reason why the solution is slightly acidic, right? So, here we saw acidic salt, ammonium chloride, when dissolved in water, results in the formation of a solution, right? And what happens in this case is, we get a strong acid and a weak base. Now, since strong acid is formed, the solution is slightly acidic. But what about basic salts? Yes, basic salts are salts whose solutions are basic in nature. Let's take a very simple example of sodium bicarbonate, which is a basic salt. Now, when we take sodium bicarbonate and dissolve it in water, what happens over here is we get weak acid carbonic acid and strong base sodium hydroxide. Now, what happens over here is the bicarbonate ion of sodium bicarbonate combines with the H plus ions of water resulting in the formation of carbonic acid H2CO3 which is a weak acid. Whereas, the sodium ion of sodium bicarbonate combines with the OH minus ions of water and thereby what I get is NaOH that is sodium hydroxide which is a strong base. Now friends, over here you can see what we've got is we've got a strong base, right? Now since we get a strong base over here, the solution is slightly basic. To learn more about this topic, download Top Scholars app.